Om Shanti. Welcome to 4th of December's Kaujil Basing. How can a happy and a content mind make your body healthy? We're going to explore that in a bit now. In his own words, Supreme Father says, May you be a constantly contented soul and remain free from any illness in your body or mind. It's double. Mind and body. Both illnesses are not there. How? With the blessing and medicine. Now, what are the blessing and what are the medicine? We will explore that. Even if your body is sometimes unwell, do not let your mind become disturbed by any illness of your body. Now, this is a very powerful way of being or living your life. Constantly continue to dance in happiness and your body will become fine. So, it's known as the detachment theory. This is what most of the uh, Rajyogis, Rajarishis, they try to do, even sadhu and sons, they try to do, that they try to detach the soul's mind and intellect from the physical body, that means detachment. But how do we do that is what we learn in Brahma Kumaris on a daily basis, the detachment theory. Make your body work with the happiness of your mind and you will exercise both. Make your body work with the happiness of your mind. So mind and body both are doing the work. And you will exercise both. What? The mind also as well as the body. So if the mind is happy, automatically the body, the muscles, the tissues, the DNA, the tendons, and blood vessels, the blood, everything will start dancing and be happy. That means energies will increase. Happiness is your blessing and exercise is your medicine. Exercising your mind with positive happy thoughts is our medicine. So with both the blessing and the medicine, you will become free from any illness in your body or mind. In this happiness, you will forget your pain. In order to be constantly content with your body and mind, do not think too much. Overthinking, worrying, overconcerned. And that leads to what? Reduction of happiness because you start looking at all the situations around us, physical situations. And when you see the physical situations, and especially in Kali Yuga, Nobody in this world has got these physical situations proper or taken care of. Why? Because there's chaos around us, as simple as that. And we, if we try to get into the chaos, think about the chaos around us, then we cannot find sense. And that's where the mind's happiness will go away and that affects the body. So what to do? Notice the things from the lens of your third eye. That means your spiritual eye. That means you're seeing the good even in the bad. And that is only possible when we are meditating. In order to be constantly content with your body and mind, do not think too much. By thinking too much, time is wasted and your happiness disappears. So then how to be happy? Even if there is chaos around us, that's what we learn in Brahma Kumaris because we can see things through beyond the five senses then. Om Shanti with this.